guys, what's up? It's Tori Lee and welcome back to my channel. So today I am going to do an at home hit workout for you guys, um, incorporating my Tori Lee Fitness booty bands. Um, because of everything that's going on with the virus, I have been stuck in the house like everybody else and I have had to get very creative on how to keep going with my training and make sure that I am still hitting my goals, um, which has been pretty challenging um, to say the least, but I know I'm not the only one. Um, I know a lot of you guys are experiencing the same thing, so I'm hoping that maybe this video will give you a little bit of motivation, um, maybe some different ideas on how you can incorporate incorporate training at your home as well. Um, let me go ahead and show you guys my bands. If you guys are not familiar with my bands, they look like this. They come in this little Tori Lee fitness um, package and there's two of them in there. So you have a turquoise one and a gray one, very on brand with my logo colors. Um, you've got my logo there. So basically a quick little description of these bands. I'm not trying to sell them to you, just kind of, I know you guys are gonna be asking what I'm using, so I'm just letting you guys know ahead of time. So these are basically, they're cloth bands on the inside. There's little grips here so that they don't slip. Um, these are a lot more effective than your traditional latex ones. Um, what I was noticing with a lot of my clients is a lot of my clients had latex allergies and they were not able to use those bands. Um, so I started to look into a different type of training bands and I ended up coming across these ones and ended up producing my own. Um, they are cloth, so you can wash them. They're not gonna roll they're not gonna snap they're not gonna do anything like that they're super durable um, this one is the gray one and this is the medium and this is 40 pounds of resistance and the blue one or the turquoise one is the small and this is 60 pounds of resistance um, the amount of resistance is super important because whenever you're glute training you want to lift as heavy as possible um, for opt optimal group glute growth for optimal group <laughs> For optimal glute growth, you need to make sure that you're lifting pretty heavy. Um, and because I'm not able to be in the gym around weights, I have had to rely solely on these and different um, household items to kind of get me to that weight that I normally am lifting in the gym, if that makes sense. So I am gonna go ahead and get started and I hope you guys enjoy. <laughs>
side note, whew. since the stay at home order, I've only really been able to train when my kids are asleep. Whew, shoot, this is kicking my butt. But basically they just woke up from their naps. So they're still a little tired. I think that's why they're not running around. Normally can't do anything <laughs> when they're up. So I've been utilizing their nap time to get my workout in. Um, Cause that's really the only time that I can get it done. Hi guys, say hi YouTube. <laughs> and um, I appreciate you guys joining me today for this home workout. I just wanna tell all of you guys to stay encouraged and stay motivated. This is only a temporary situation and hoping that by watching this video, it kind of fuels your guys' tank. Um, just so you guys know, I am cheering for you. I am you know, supporting you. I want you to accomplish your goals um, and stay focused. So keep pushing. We're all in this together and we all need each other to get through this. So I'm gonna do one more round and then I will see you guys later. things with you so one of the other things that I'm trying to make sure that I'm doing every day is have at least two of these half gallons full of water um, when I am out and about running around all day I think it's easier for me to be mindful of how much water I'm drinking versus just sitting in the house um, so I am a very visual person and instead of drinking a lot of water bottles or just glasses of water I've been utilizing this jug and I have really been pushing myself to get two of these in a day and I will say it makes so much more of a difference when you are drinking that much water. I was, I had a couple days where I was getting like really intense headaches. My anxiety was through the roof. Um, I just felt like really sluggish and just not very motivated. And as soon as I started making sure that my water consumption was where it needed to be, all of that changed. Another thing that I'm doing to hold myself accountable and make sure that I'm getting everything done is I put together this little self-care routine board. It looks like this excuse my 
chicken scratch because my handwriting is super ugly. Um, but basically what I did was I broke down each days and I made sure to focus on what body parts I was training and then what I was doing with my hair care and my skincare. Um, so today is a Thursday, so I had a hit in abs, which is what I'm doing today. Um, my daily reminders consist of taking all supplements, um, making sure that I am being mindful of my skincare routine, my hair care routine, and making sure that I'm meditating and praying every day. Um, I pray every day in general, but I want it to be more intentional. Um, I have an accountability journal slash success journal, and in that journal, it really makes you um, be mindful of the different things that you're thankful for and making sure that you take the time each day to thank God for all of those blessings um, that he had bestowed upon us, um, especially in these really tough times. It's super hard to stay positive, and it's very challenging to feel like you are, you know, in a good situation. So just doing these little things is really helping me keep my mind sane and keeping me motivated because like I said earlier this situation is so temporary and I know that a lot of us are really really going through it um, you know just to kind of get into my personal life both of my businesses have been shut down completely um, and I was very very anxious and nervous to see you know how this was all gonna play out but I am a strong believer that, you know, God is going to make sure or higher power, whatever you believe in. I'm not super religious. So I don't want to sit here and preach to you guys. But whatever that higher power is that you believe in is going is not going to put you in a situation that you cannot handle. And I believe that to the fullest. Thank you so much. That is it for today. It is time for me to attend to these crazy children of mine. I appreciate you guys watching. Make sure to <laughs> like, comment and subscribe and Hopefully, I will see you guys soon. Uh, make sure to connect with me if you guys want some ideas for workouts at home. I'll be more than happy to supply that for you guys. So, yeah, thank you for watching, and I'll see you soon. Bye.